Dr. Salvasoro and I work for the University of Nevada Reno Extension. Uh, we've been doing some uh, videos to give you ideas now that we have our children at home. Uh, you know, some tips on how to keep them occupied and entertained, but also at the same time they could learn something while they're having fun. Today I want to talk to you uh, about indoor and outdoor play and also some screen time. How can we mix all those together, especially with our young children? So I have the opportunity to have a two-year-old and a six-year-old today. And as we make the videos and we record them in different settings, I, I would like you to observe their uh, body language, their face, uh, whether they seem interested, whether they don't like it or they just don't pay attention. And remember there's a difference of age so you can see both the two-year-old and the six-year-old and then you could decide. Hope you like my tips and we're going to, uh, first I want you to see some outdoor playing with the uh, children. Okay, if you could just come with me. Start with uh, a game that we're all familiar with and I'm going to introduce my six-year-old and see what he does but also keep an eye on the two-year-old, see if he follows. Okay, you ready? Yeah. So remember. Go on your own. Go one. Start. Hop. Hop. One foot. On one foot. One. Go. One. One. Two. One. One. Two. Turn around. One. One. Two. One. One. Another fun activity to do is to use chalk as we slowly uh, use the chalk to do our hot spots. But they could do some writing too. On plain paper, or if you have construction color paper, it's uh, fun for them to draw or make letters or sim simply play a game of tic tac toe. Are you ready? So, are you circles or X's? Okay, put your first circle. And I'll put my X. Oh, you put your circle wherever you want. Okay, I put my X. Where's another circle? Talk to you. You do it wherever you want to. Okay, he drew a number three. You were supposed to put in a circle. Make a circle. Okay, I'm gonna put my X right here. How about putting a circle here? Draw the circle. Okay, and when you do is one, two, three, that means you won, because you got three in a row. Okay, sometimes you gotta let them win so that they don't get mad at you. We got my little uh, two-year-old, and he just does whatever he wants. Onyx, what are you doing? Are you writing your name? Can you write your name? O N X Y X Circle. Can you do it? Just find fun, uh, fun ideas. Go, baby. Good job. Go on, Your turn.
Okay, now we're going to uh, include in our games the last screen time with the, the kids. As you can see, we try to look for educational apps for our six-year-old. Our six-year-old right now, even though it's not recommended for children under two to be playing uh, video games, right now at this age, what they just like to use their visual uh, uh, abilities in watching music or just watching cartoons. So I'm gonna go and, and work right here with my six-year-old. And it's an app where they use their fingers to trace the ABC. So can you can you show me your finger? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Can you trace? Okay. And we're gonna trace the arrow down, 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 and across. What letter is that? A. And A is four. A. I can not press the arrow, and we got what letter? B. B. B is for bag. B is for bag. So we're gonna follow the arrow down, and we're gonna make a curve. Okay. Okay. Yeah. You try doing it by yourself. And remember, parents, just divide their activities. Children get tired of routine, so it's hard to keep them. You did it. Good job. Okay. Now put the arrow. And uh, when you include some of the screen time, don't uh, don't forget participate with them. Sit down and see what they're doing and how are they doing the activity. Good job. You did it. What letter is that? V. V. Now push the arrow and go on the this next. One? Yes, that's the arrow. Uh oh. Oh, can we? There you go. Where they see that? That's the letter. What letter is that? C. C. Now use C your finger and trace. Trace it. Follow the arrow and trace. Okay. Let them choose what they want to play. Remember, when you make it uh, a discipline, or no. just you want them to do what you. No. Uh, what you feel that they need no. to do next, that's no. when the fighting no. starts. So let them no. um, choose no. what activity no. they want to um, do next. And like I said, keep it fun, okay? No. Thank you so much. Hope you enjoy our video. No. And hopefully it helps you. No. And just keep tuned for no. the next video. Once again, my name is Olga Soto. No. And I'll see you next time. Thank you.